hello students welcome to topchran team so today we are going to understand the uh, summary of the poem the road not taken by robert frost okay this is a very famous poem and as a student of english language and literature you should know the summary of this poem and this poem will definitely be there in your syllabus whether if you are doing your bachelor's or masters is very important poem okay so let's understand the summary this poem is about a person who is walking in the woods and comes across a fork in the road which means uh, there are two paths two paths or two ways to choose from the man has to choose from two ways like when you have to decide between two different games to play the person thinks about which path to take and even though both paths looks nice they decide to take one that fewer people have taken before so it's like when you choose a special toy to play with that not many of your friends have the person in the poem feels happy about their choice and thinks that it will make a big difference in their life they say that when they look back on this moment in the future they will be glad they took the less traveled path so the poem is teaching us that sometimes life we have to make choices and it's okay to choose a path that feels right for us even if it's not the same as what everyone else is doing so it's about being brave and making our own way in the world <laughs> then the poem also talks about how uh, when the person gets older and looks back on their life they'll remember the choice they made in the woods it's like when you grow up and remember the special friends you made or the fun adventures you had when you were younger the most important thing the poem tells us is that making choices is a part of life and it's okay to choose what feels right for us even if it's different from what others choose it's like picking your favorite ice cream flavor everyone has chosen their own favorite and that's perfectly fine so the road not taken is a poem that reminds us to be brave trust ourselves make our own choices in life just like picking the path that feels best for us in the woods now let's understand the line by line summary of this poem the road not taken by robert frost okay two roads diverged in a yellow wood this means that there are two paths or two ways in a forest i'm sorry i could not travel both the person wishes they could walk on both sides but they have to choose one which means he have to choose one of the two paths and be one traveler long i stood which means he stand there for a while thinking about which path to pick and looked down one as far as i could he looked as far as he can down the first path to where it bent in the undergrowth this he see that the first path disappears into the bushes then took the other just as fair he decide to take the second path which also looks nice and having perhaps the better claim he think this path might be a better choice because it was grassy and wanted wear which which means the path has grass and looks like need someone to walk on it though as for that the passing there which means both paths seem like he people haven't been walked on much had worn them really about the same actually both paths are equally worn and both that morning equally lay both paths are just as good as good on that day in leaves no step had trodden black which means nobody has walked on the leaves on either path yet which means the leaves from the trees have fallen on the path and nobody has walked um on the leaves oh i kept the first for another day which means the person uh, he could come back and try the first path another time which means the person wishes that uh, he could come back and try the first path another time 
yet knowing how obey leads on to way which means but they understand that once they choose one path it leads to other choices i doubted if i should ever come back they are not sure if they will ever return to the sport i shall be telling this with a sigh in the future he'll walk about this decision with a sigh like a big breath somewhere ages and ages hence which means a long long time from now two roads diverged in a word and i which means they'll say that they had to choose between two paths i took the one less traveled by he picked the path that not many people had walked on and that has made all the difference and this choice made their life special and unique so this poem is about someone is making choice between two paths in the woods and feeling like it was an important decision in their life it like it's like picking which toy to play with and they choose the one that felt special to them okay understood then and now let's understand the themes of this poem first is making choices this poem is about how sometimes we have to make decisions like choosing which game to play or what toy to pick it tells us it's okay to make our own choices even if they are different from what others choose next theme is being brave the poem teaches us to be brave when making decisions like when we try something new or pick a different path in a game it's about having the courage to do what feels right to us next is being unique just like how each toy or game is different the poem says it's okay to be different too we don't always have to do what everyone else is doing we can be special and unique next theme is looking back the poem talks about how when we grow up and remember our choices we might feel happy about the special things we did when we were younger it's like looking at old photos and smiling because we remember the fun times so the rod not taken as a poem that reminds us as to make our own choices be brave be ourselves and look back on our decisions with happiness that's all about the rod not taken by robert frost if you understood the poem if you understood the summary please do subscribe to tobin sharan team thank you